Many people spend time using computers and phones before bed. But did you know that there's a high chance that this could be affecting the quality of your sleep? To explain it, Luna's got to get a little technical. Everyone has what's known as a circadian rhythm, also known as an internal body clock. This rhythm is affected by light, meaning you feel more energized in the day and more sleepy at night. Have you noticed in wintertime it's harder to wake up when it's dark in the morning? The body clock itself is all controlled by a hormone called melatonin, which is released in the evening to make you feel sleepy. Blue light from phones and other electronic devices has been shown to stop melatonin from releasing. In short, this could lead to you feeling less sleepy when it's time for bed. And by extension, you could end up being more tired and irritable in the day due to lack of sleep. So, how can you avoid using your phone? Yes, this is easier said than done, given most of our entertainment and downtime comes from our phones. But there are a few things that you can try to get a better night's sleep. These include, by using dark mode on your phone to reduce the brightness, make your room a phone free zone, and if you don't trust yourself to do it, you can ask a family member or sibling to hide your phone for you before bed. And finally, find entertainment in other things, like reading, a Kindle is also fine to use, art, writing, skincare, or planning outfits. The key is to stop looking at your phone one to two hours before you go to sleep. So if you need to use it all evening, just focus on avoiding it those last couple of hours. Try a podcast instead. It's definitely worth trying some of these out, as sleep is so important to making us feel better and giving us that healthy glow. So good luck and hopefully you get the rest that you need.